Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. This is the inside of the Veltins Arena, a sea of royal blue, the colours of Schalke. This is the lineup we've been given. How do you read it, Jim? Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There is a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running and it enables risk-taking while the gaps are filled. I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works. It's still valid. And I think we're going to see it be successful here. That gets things running. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Shot a goal! And there's an early warning shot across the bow. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Going for goal! It's there! Oh, it's a keeper's nightmare, Peter. He just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late, having so many bodies in front of him. Hoffenheim ahead, one goal to the good. And it's played forward, gets into a dangerous position. He's got options out wide. Oh, that's me. He's had a shot! Looking for a decent ball in. Cessignon goes looking. Real chance to break. Well played, he saw that coming. Tries to get it forward quickly. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, the referee's given it. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Hoffenheim ran themselves into the proverbial cul-de-sac there. Going through. Oh, that's a fine challenge. Hoists it forward. Oh, 
good interception. Well, that's pretty clear. It is a foul. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Going for goal! And the ball's come out. Goes for it. He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. it away shoots oh impressive strike do I really need to tell you Peter that he has to do better especially from there it out to the flank Kramaric it's Kramaric keeper's not concerned by that they're probably getting frustrated by the lack of chances I suppose Promising move that, good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Keeper's got good distance on that. The referee's awarded a free kick. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Shoots! Lacking in accuracy. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong may come right. Sessignon, Hoffenheim scored early of course, and the score is 1-0. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Chooses to go back, has a hit! Decent strike, kept it fizzing low. Kramaric can strike him with the very best. It just lacked the accuracy to trick the keeper. Rudy does well there, alert.
And now they can launch a counter. Kramaric spreads it towards the left. Crunching tackle. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing but instead he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here has a pop gets the chance to cross Kramaric more than happy Kramaric with a definite fell there he is going into that little black book. <laughs> Keeper sends it forward. No, no way through there. Plenty waiting in the middle. Oh, what a ball! Kramaric. Oh, the ball's... And we've reached half-time. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. How can they protect it? Hoffenheim are in at half time with a slender one goal lead. And we are already promptly back on the way. Hoffenheim going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. And that's sprayed out wide. He's had a goal! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class weight. An uncompromising challenge. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter. Once he got into that position, it's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Defenders on the back foot. Cessignon. Hoffenheim just about have their noses in front. It is the slenderest of leads. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Oh, that's a booking. Always looked it. Schalke making another change here. Two changes being made right now. Forward it goes. And he's there to cut it out. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. It just has to be done. Well, that's where he wants it. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Cessignon. Get it 
forward quickly. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Dinks one in, and it's got through. That'll be a throw. Schalke making consecutive changes here. Bentaleb, Bentaleb delivers. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Kramaric. Ostasic. That's a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. Well, they can break here. And helps available out wide. Bully gets rid without sophistication. Tremor, Tremoric! Oh, and that should have been two. Tremoric really did let them off the hook. They could have wrapped it all up. Hoffenheim are making a change now. Loses his balance and loses the ball. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Bentaleb. Bentaleb drives it forward. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Hoffenheim just have to run down the clock. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Hoists it forward. Could move up a gear here. Sessignon. Surely a foul free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. Much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Chance to break. And that's that. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Well, Peter, 